Hello, welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time watching, my name is Gigi and this is Style by Glad. For today, I'm doing a long overdue styling video. Right behind me, I have some clothes from Princess Polly that I recently purchased and I wanted to do a haul plus styling style video for you guys. It's been a minute since I've done a fashion related pose. My life has literally turned upside down in June. If you have been watching my vlogs, you would know my dog was diagnosed with a oral uh, mass and was cancerous. So we spent most of our time taking care of her, trying to get her to the doctors and get her the treatments that she needed. Thank God um, we were able to get her the help that she needed. She got the surgery and she's currently going through radiation treatment. She's reacting really well to it. So far, so good. I'm not gonna, you know, fingers crossed. And yeah, so that's also why I haven't been as active and as on time compared to before, but I really want to thank everybody that is, you know, subscribing and also continue to watch my videos. Thank you guys so much. And honestly, it means a lot. Before moving on, of course, got to plug a little bit. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button and also give this video a thumbs up. If you haven't as well, uh, follow me on TikTok as well as Instagram. I post on there on a daily basis. Definitely come by say hi and don't be shy. Now with that all said, let's move on to the actual styling and haul of this video. All right, behind me is the Princess Polly pieces that I've recently purchased. Some of them you might have seen me already worn on uh, my vlogs and stuff. I kind of purchased them in two separate buys. I've never shopped from Princess Polly before. Before I, you know, purchased more, I wanted to make sure I know how their fits are. And just to give you guys an idea, I usually wear an extra small to a small depending on the brand. I do have to say for Princess Polly, I am wearing extra small. It does fit quite snugly and is pretty true to size. Some brands that run even smaller, like the European brands, I do have to go size up a little bit on the size small instead of extra small. I basically looked at their sizing chart and used it as a reference and that's how I made my purchase. So their sizing chart is pretty um, accurate. You can definitely reference that. Now on to the pieces, other than just showing you the pieces, I'll pop up an outfit that I style and how I would wear those pieces. First up, we have this little crop tank top with a graphic in front. They do a lot of these like vintage motor graphics. The fabric is a little bit more on the polyester end. I, it's not a true cotton. It has that rib, but I do really like this texture. It's very stretchy and easy to wear and it has that more like flowy look to it. It is more sheer. So with this top, because it's so sheer, I do layer it over another like crop tank just to kind of make it a little bit less see-through through and I usually wear it with like some baggier jeans give it that like 90s look and with some sneakers it's a cute everyday combo that you can easily wear. Next up we have this ruched um, on the two sides little white tank top. I've been wearing this so much maybe you can already tell it's been worn. I really like this. They actually come in black as well as a tan color and I'm definitely considering purchasing it too. The only thing with the white again it's kind of see-through and I've actually hung it on the hanger with the tank that I'm always styling it with. I got this little like lace trim tank from Free People. It just layers really nicely. It kind of adds to the look of anything because the lace does pop out a little bit on the tank on the side. So I wear this as a set now. I always wear it together. Again, some easy jeans with some heels. It would be really cute too. Next up is this little bralette top. I got it in brown because I wanted a little bit more of that earthy tone to match to my like more tan color items in my closet. I have this pair of tan color jeans that I think it will look really great next to. This little guy is made of this really stretchy rib fabric and they also double layered it in the front, made it really easy to just wear it alone. I don't think you even need to worry about it not 
being able to cover and this little top is definitely on the more like going out and night look i do have a trip coming up to vegas and i kind of bought it for that i would wear this with the tan colored jeans and probably throw on a little like blazer jacket for a cute nighttime look following up the next guy we have a graphic tee again they like i mentioned earlier it seems like princess polly has a lot of these like grungy you know motor themed graphics i really like the color scheme of this and it's an easy white tee it's oversized for sure i got the small i want to say i got the size four instead of the extra small for this i did go up a size because i like that extra oversized the fit itself is already oversized but i went up one little size just to make sure it does have that oversized feeling to it you know for this guy most days i'll probably wear it with sneakers but i Feel like these will look cool with some like boots as well just throw on and layer it on and give it that grungy look as well the white on the shirt though it's not i know it's kind of it's not you can't really tell through the camera maybe but it's a off white so it it seems like they did a wash on it it gave it that vintage vibe to it and i really like it now going on to another more everyday top we have this a linen style oversized button-up shirt i bought this first because i feel like for the summertime it'll be a cute little layer over any tank or any like cami or bodysuit and also i feel like it'll make a cute little beach look as well if you need to wear it over your swimsuit and whatnot it has this like sheer more um sheer fabric to it for sure and it has a vertical stripe pattern overall it's a very easy to wear it's oversized drop shoulder very laid back casual classic i feel like for a full summer look you can pair it with a pair of linen pants or just easy blue jeans i'm a sucker for anything that can i can wear with jeans i i live and die in my jeans so yep now moving on to dresses this first one is for sure a pop of color both of the dresses that you'll see is on the midi to like kind of a maxi i wouldn't say it's a full true maxi but definitely a midi length and maybe this one is a little bit longer than that this one it has a little ruched detail on the side and it has an opening here for a cutout like look the fabric itself it's that rib fabric again back is a little bit cut on the bias where it kind of shifts a little bit because i think it's because of this that it's pulling it that way but overall it's pretty standard it's like a ribbed dress but adds a little bit more to the fit and especially with this color i thought it would be perfect for the summertime probably planning to wear this in vegas as well last but not least we have this midi floral dress i really really like this fit it fits beautifully especially in the neckline and also they make sure to line the bust area because there is a little bit of a tie front opening here right down the center and it makes it kind of hard for you to wear a bra or anything underneath but the fact that they lined it and also the fit is just really good on this one so i was very pe pleasantly surprised the fabric itself on its own the bottom the rest of the fabric i wouldn't say it's the most thick kind of fabric but it is summertime it's a summer dress i didn't expect it to be super thick either i kind of want it more light and flowy it does fit more snugly and has gives you a nice silhouette i think other than just re wearing it casually it will make a cute summer dress to wear with heels as well and i highly highly recommend this dress i actually wore this for my jewelry review and so this dress i did purchase like closer to last month i just never did a haul <laughs> to share it and yeah it's one of my new favorite dresses to wear now and that is all for today's haul thank you guys so much for watching feel free to leave comments or ask any questions about sizing or the style or any other uh, questions you might have that i did not answer in this video about you know shopping on the princess poly site overall i do have to say i was pleasantly surprised by their quality as well as their fit given they are more on the fast fashion end their pricing is decent it's reasonable i feel like their styles and a lot of their silhouettes is more up to date and in trend with what is uh currently 
you know, trending and what is currently like people want to wear and buy. Below, I'll make sure to link all the styles that I've mentioned today. This video isn't sponsored. I did purchase these styles for myself. The links are affiliated. So I'm just going to give you guys a heads up and let you guys know. And I hope you enjoy this video. Thank you so much again for joining me. And I hope to see you guys on the next one.